In 1989, the Baton Rouge Culinary Federation named Kim Kringley Chef of the Year, and in 1990, he was named Louisiana's Best Seafood Chef. From his current restaurant, Dakota, he prepares a dazzling dessert, coconut mousse in a chocolate shell. First thing uh, we're gonna do is add the, uh, the chocolate to the crock. This is the coating milk chocolate. Also, we wanna have our water at a slow simmer because you want to melt the chocolate slow so it doesn't have a tendency to clump up. Melting the coating chocolate takes some time. Once your chocolate is melted and nice and smooth, we're going to add our chopped macadamia nuts. And we take the balloons, which we've blown up, and we're going to dip them in the chocolate. to about halfway up the balloon. You also want to set them at an angle so when you set them on the plate, they won't be standing straight up. And then we can uh, put them in the refrigerator and let them chill. The coconut cream cheese mousse begins by softening eight ounces of cream cheese. Cream of coconut. Two ounces of cream of coconut were added, plus four ounces of powdered sugar. And a little powdered sugar. After the coconut mixture is thoroughly combined, whipped cream is folded in. Once the coconut shells have hardened, we're going to take the balloons. Remove them from the shell. To the uh, cream cheese mousse, we're going to add a little bit of shredded sweetened coconut. We'll take the shells, fill them with the mousse. And then you want to return them to the freezer so they have a chance to sit up for a few minutes. The English cream begins with four egg yolks beaten with a half cup of sugar. And we'll add the sugar to the egg yolks. You want to whip it until it's nice and fluffy and pale in color. When the egg yolks have absorbed the sugar, three-fourths cup heavy cream and one-half cup milk, which have been scalded, are added. Then remove the sauce from the bowl back into the pot. You want to slowly heat it until it just begins to thicken up a little bit. You can also add our vanilla at this point. You want to make sure you stir it constantly so the eggs don't curdle in the sauce. The English cream will be strained and cooled before serving. Take a melon ball and scoop out a center. Take the chilled English cream and then 
out of the coconut. We'll garnish the plate with a little bit of caramel sauce. Chocolate sauce. 